Hey. So, <clears throat> excuse my appearance. Um, I don't have a shirt on, so I decided to throw a blanket on. It's just one of those days. I don't even need to explain it to you. It's just one of them days. You know what I'm talking about? Okay, so the topic is, um, if I could travel in time, would I go back and fo backwards or forwards? Or would I, uh, and what would I do if I were there? So, definitely wouldn't go forward. No, no, not having that. I don't need to see what I'm going to turn out to be. I would definitely go backwards. And I don't really care about what was going on in the past. What I would do is I would go back in time. And, um, I would convince, like, I assume that I would be looking like this going back in time. I'd go back in time, um... And I'd tell my mom and my dad and my stepmom to invest in stock for Apple and, like, Sony and, uh, post it and stuff like that so that they get real, 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 rich. And then I wouldn't have to do anything. I could just sit around and just, like, spend money all day. On wheat thins and planters nuts and shirts because I don't have any. No, I have shirts, so I just don't have one on right now. <clears throat> and I was gonna do a vlog. <clears throat> That's my fish tank right there. Right there. Uh, I was gonna do a vlog without a shirt, but like, that's too chat roulette y. I was on chat roulette today with my friends because I was at a birthday party. It was pretty fun. We were talking about the. We are talking to this guy from Romania. It's pretty cool. Um. So, yeah, I'd go back in time and tell, and tell my parents to invest in stock so that I could be loaded for life from the beginning. I suppose um, it would be interesting to go back in time to when dinosaurs existed. That'd be pretty fun. Just so I could see, see some velociraptors. I don't need to, like, encounter them because they spit acid and shit, but... It'd be nice to observe them. Purely observation, purely observationistic. Um, and if I could invent something like futuristic technology, I'm trying to think because everything's pretty much been invented. And I could say, oh, teleportation, but like that's kind of already been invented, and like the concept is already here. Um, wheat thins are delicious. I'm sorry. I would probably have to invent, like, a button that just, like, produces a wheat thin out of thin air. Like, a wheat thin, like, not like, not like, oh, look, a little two inch by two inch wheat thin. I'm talking about, like, a fucking wheat thin, like, BAM! Like, this big. Like, wheat thins the size of your motherfucking house blankets and shit. Like, two foot by two foot wheat thins. So, yeah, I'd have to invent a little, um, button that produces wheat thins. Um, it would look something like this. Not affiliated with Walmart, but... It's not from Walmart, by the way. You press it and BING! Little wheat thin. Except a big wheat thin. Yep. And, I mean, I can't really... I mean, it's, I'm not gonna draw it, because this is just a better representation. This is what I would use. A wheat thin button. Because I really can't think of... A, we have electric cars, we have teleportation, kind of. And we have, um... The ability to clone things. We can... Harness the sun's energy. We can harness the wind's energy. We pretty much got our shit on lock, except for the wheat thin button. We have yet to invent that. I got to go to the store to buy these bitches. So, to recap, invest in stock. Uh, go back in time and tell my parents to invest in stock. Go visit the dinosaurs. Okay. And make a wheat thin button so that I can have giant ass wheat thins on demand. 24-7. Have a good day. Okay.